Good morning, everybody. Uh, this is going to be a, another quick uh, little video just to show you how to grease bearings that are, uh, these are like a one piece bearing. They don't have an external seal or anything, but uh, sometimes you want to get some fresh grease in there. And the old method says you put a blob of grease on here and take your thumb and you sit there and try to squish it down. Well, actually, I've got a better way. Um, you need a grease gun. And then on the end of that grease gun, you're going to need, uh, you can get these at any auto parts store. It's a it's a small hypodermic needle with a grease fitting on the end. You just snap into your gun. And you can see that end of that is cut at an angle. And uh, you're also going to need, um, this is a rubber mastic. Uh, they use this for sealing duct work. And uh, it's a non-hardening, almost like a silly putty. But uh, I'm going gonna, I'm, I'm gonna to show you, I'm going to set up the mag base and show you how to, uh, how to grease these things quick and easy without making a big mess and without... Uh, sitting there trying to squish them down there with your thumbs and not knowing if you got it all in there or got a good pack on it. Okay, let me set up the mag base and I'll show you the rest. Okay, here's uh, here's what we're going to do. I want you to see the back side of this bearing. Back in here, see that thing's dry as a bone. Now we're going to take, uh, take our hypodermic here, clean it. And we're also going to rub down the face of the bearing with a little bit of acetone just to get all the oil off of it. And actually, I can, you can wipe down this silly putty too. If you got any little bit of grease on there or something from the previous bearing, and uh, just kind of fold it back into itself and get everything mixed. Uh, this stuff is uh, cheap and readily accessible. Uh, actually, if you got any buddies in the HVAC industry, they use this to glue uh, ductwork together with. And it comes in very large rolls. It's called a rubber, a butyl rubber mastic. Okay, so we're going to put the angled section down right on the split of the bearing. Push the silly putty down over it to create a seal. Hold firmly. Give it a pump. You're going to get some leakage out here like this. But you can see it's pushing out out of the bearing. And now I'm going to show you the back side of the bearing. Right there, where, where it pushed through, all the way through the bearing. You pushed all that, all that out through there. So you know that bearing's got a nice fresh pack in it, and it just feels silky smooth now. So that's how you uh, service non-serviceable bearings when they just uh, need another quick shot of lube.